what's up peeps it's your friendly neighborhood youtuber guys and guess what we are back at it again with another i don't know what i'm gonna call this video guys this is not really a collection video um this is kind of me just wanting to give a shout out to everybody in the toy collecting community and also you know i just want to touch um, on to a few things, uh, what you're seeing right here in front of me is my Marvel Legends collection. I'm just kind of shooting this video. They're not really organized, uh, how I want them to be, but I'm actually in the process of moving, uh, into a bigger place. Um, so here's my Marvel Legends collection. Really not complete, really not where I want it to be. Over here, all the way up here is my Marvel Select collection. There's Spawn hanging out with the gargoyle right there. Um, but I just wanted to show you a glimpse of this, you know, one day I'll do a collection video, but one thing I just wanted to touch on, um, actually the title of this video is going to be called, uh, toy collecting, the art of toy collecting. Why so serious? And the reason why, um, it's going to be named that title guys is because, well, you know, a lot of, um, I get a lot of awesome, um, comments on YouTube um, and a lot of support from you guys on YouTube and the toy collecting community but there's just some of you guys that just take this thing it just you guys just take this thing way way too seriously man and it's just we're collecting toys and I get a lot of you know I, I most of the comments like 90 maybe 95 percent of the comments I get you know are positive but you know it's always that 10 five percent of people that just you know, leave stupid comments on your page and, you know, and you, you, you know, try to talk to them and you try to say, hey, you know, this and that, and they just don't get it. And then, you know, I usually give them a second chance and they, if they you leave something, you know, hateful on my page, then I'll just, <laughs> again, I'll just block them. You know, that's what I usually do. I, I've blocked a few people on, on YouTube you know, just because, you know, well, you know, you didn't talk about this character, you know, your lack of knowledge on this character, on this figure, you know, you shouldn't even be a toy reviewer. I'm just a collector who happened to start his own YouTube channel, man. I'm not a professional toy reviewer, whatever you want to call it. Um, but uh, I just decided... There's my there's one of my art pieces. Here's my dartboard. I'm gonna come down to my NECA collection just to get you uh have your guys' attention on me, you know, um doing a little venting. And it's just not even that serious, guys. Um this is actually my my NECA, my McFarlane co collection right here, predators and horror villains and and other uh other action figures, my ninja turtle. Uh, my Ninja Turtles right here, 1990 Ninja Turtles. Uh, but my collection's not set up how I want it to set up, so that's why this is not a collection video. This is just kind of a walkthrough of some of the stuff that I have. Um, you know, but going back to a lot of disgruntled YouTube um, uh, people on YouTube, it's just not that serious, man. I mean, listen, it, we are collecting toys. That's what we do, you know. Um, you know, I try to give the best review of uh, of the figure that I can, you know, can I do a little bit more research? Yeah, but I just mostly buy the action figure because, you know, I, I like the action figure. Like, for example, I'll give you a couple examples. Pennywise, you know, I grew up with Pennywise. He was like a big part of my childhood. He was like one of the scariest horror villains in the history of horror movies. So I have a lot of knowledge about this Pennywise, <clears throat> you know, as far as uh, Deathstroke right here, I don't know. I don't know much about him. I bought him because I thought he was cool. I know he's part of the DC universe, but my knowledge on his story is uh, pretty much zero. So, you know, so that's me as a collector. You know, I, I I don't buy action figures that I know a lot about. Sometimes I just buy action figures just based on how they look in this death stroke is a perfect perfect example you know same thing with these predators you know when you buy a predator action figure this hornhead predator which i just recently did a review of i don't know the story of hornhead predator i just bought him because he was freaking cool man you know but there's so many you know people out there in the youtube universe that just criticize you over stupid crap you know it's just like really 
dude, you know, you want to make a lame comment about, oh, well, you don't know about this and you don't know about that and blah, 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 and all this crap. And just like, come on, guys. It's just freaking toys. That's all it is. You know, I know there's YouTubers out there that make a living off of doing this. I don't make any money off of doing this, guys. I just collect action figures. Actually, I spend more money than the money that I make. <laughs> I mean, I find different avenues of making money from these action figures, like selling off accessories and, and, and interchangeable hands and heads and stuff on the internet, but that really goes back into buying more action figures. So I don't really make money off of, you know, off of my channel. And nor is that my plan, you know, to make money off of my channel. I'm not relying on my channel to make money. I just like buying action figures. You know, I said this before and I said this uh, and I'll say this again. You know, I'm somebody, I'm a toy collector who liked collecting toys and I decided to start my own YouTube channel. And Really, if I didn't have my own YouTube channel, I would still be collecting action figures. It's as simple as that, guys. And uh, and that's kind of what I wanted to get off my head. You know, I started this channel. I said this in the previous review, you know, when I was doing a review of another action figure. You know, I started this channel a month after my mom passed. And I don't know if that kind of was the result of me coping with, you know, my mother's death. But that's... One of the main reasons why I started my YouTube channel. Uh, so over here, I'm not going to get into great lengths of all these action figures. I'll go through a more, um, a more in-depth review collection video. You know, when I have time, when I have everything set up properly. But everything is just kind of scattered all over the place and what have you. And then over here to the left, I've showed you guys this before. This is all my entire spawn collection. And don't mind all these like little particles that are flying everywhere. It's just dust and debris. <laughs> and probably cat hair as well. And yeah, these are all my McFarlane action figures, guys. So this is kind of like um, a collection video, but not really. I showed you a lot of these spawn figures. If you guys didn't see uh, any of these spawn figures, I did... Uh, my spawn collection as of 2018. I'll probably do another one in the near future, but you can see how dusty it is. I'm not going to dust anything. Like I said, I'm in the process of moving, so I'll be in a new place next month. But I just wanted to do a little venting and at the same time capture your attention with some of these uh, figures that I have. And look at all the debris, man. Look at all this dust that you see flying around on my screen. And then, yeah, up here, this is some of my art right here. And up here is my Marvel Marvel Select Collection. I'll try to go up close so you guys can see. Some of the figures have passed out <laughs> and fell over. And I just wanted to give you a quick glimpse of my collection. I'm still not done. I'm still always collecting. I think a collector always collects. And some of my art right here as well. I do some art over here. And then some of the animated stuff that I do, uh, that I collect, excuse me, some spawn figures that I have yet to open. Doomsday, you got Jack Skeleton Bank right there, a skull that I made. And these are more like the animated figures, Mario, Yoshi, and Sonic. But, listen, you know, we collect toys, this is what we do for fun, you know, so... You know, I just want a lot of my viewers and a lot of people who watch my channel just to leave positive comments, man. Don't leave negative comments because I will block you. <laughs> I've done it before and I'll do it again. Uh, here's some of my art as well. But, um, yeah, I mean, just try to stay positive, guys. I mean, let's be a part of the community. Let's not try to tear each other down. And, uh, like, Lego Darth Vader over here, so... But yeah, I just wanted to give you a quick glimpse of my collection as of right now and just vent, do a little venting, make a little short video and just let you guys know how I feel and where my channel stands right now. So there you guys have it. Um, if you like this little video, let me know what you guys think of this little review. And when I get set up in my, my new place, I'll be more organized and i'll give you guys a better tour but i just wanted to do a little venting right now so leave your thoughts in the comments guys uh tell me what you guys think and uh about toy collecting why do you collect 
so on and so forth. And just let me know your thoughts in the comments, guys. So we'll go ahead and leave it at that. We'll come back over here to the my Marvel Legends collection as of right now, as of, what is it, August 4th, 2009. And yeah, there's still a lot of figures that you can't see because they're kind of buried and I don't have it set up the way I want it set up. So um, I'll give you a future tour in the future. <laughs> if that made any sense so there you guys have it let me know what you guys think let me know what you guys want to see more of and we'll leave it at that guys and i just want to thank you guys for watching and i'll catch you guys later bye